Welcome back to another exciting episode of Minecraft. In the last episode, I have a little lag here because I just started the game up and you know how it is. DRM and all that nonsense. Oh, hello, creeper! Oh my goodness, haha, ha, didn't hurt. I really should eat something though because that could have been bad. Well, last time. I went way, way up into the clouds. Oh my goodness, the lag is so tremendous. It's not even letting me... Okay. And the sun is setting. How convenient. You know, I realized why it was so dark. I thought I saw another creeper over there. I realized why it was so dark last time. Because it was raining off in the distance, and I didn't know that the game could do that necessarily. Because I usually thought that the rain meant rain, and it rained everywhere. The sky was dark. But that's why there were so many issues with that. But I've come back to you in this 18th installment of the Minecraft Amplified series. Sorry you didn't get a video yesterday, but, you know, stuff and things. But we're doing it today, and I'm going to record all, as many of these as I can today, because it is it is uh, a little bit of extra work. It's worth it, but it's extra work to do the face cam thing. And that's been a, uh, a bit of a controversial subject on the channel, you know. And part of the reason is because... Oh my goodness. Part of the reason is because I have uh, basically been trying something different and I have explained this but some of you just aren't getting it. But you are my viewers and your opinion matters to me. So what I want to say first and foremost is that I am primarily doing this face cam and I could be wrong but this is the reason, the main reason. The main reason that I am doing this face cam is because I see the impact that it has on the videos. When I watch face cams of other YouTubers, whether they're famous or not, I... Uh-oh. <laughs> Bless me. Thank you. What? Uh oh Ah! Ah! No! No! I, I knew that was going to happen, but I didn't know where it was. <laughs> Anyway, when I watch other YouTubers with their face cam, and I admit the ones that are good at it, <coughs> I usually watch. <coughs> Whew. I suppose I wasn't ready globular globularly. When I watch them, and I see what they do, and I see their reactions, and I know I understand the point. They're doing it because it adds a layer of 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 entertainment that just isn't there without it. And what I mean by that is, it's, I've always acted like I do when you see the face cam. But you haven't seen, ah, I broke my pick. I have a diamond pick, that's right. I'll just use that. There we go. When you see that, it adds an element there that wasn't there before, and I think it improves it. Now, maybe people don't like looking at my ugly mug, I don't know, that's always a possibility. But it seems like it is a benefit, and I get a lot of positive feedback about it, too. So, this is just like the old days when I had to sort out who liked what and who didn't. And try to figure out what's best for my viewers and for the channel. Because I am trying to actively grow the channel. And something happened that some of you that read my comments might have been aware of. And I see you, monsters. I see you trying to attack me, but it won't work because I am aware! <laughs> And something happened that some of you may be aware of, and it was the Reddit incident. And YouTube has a sharing option. I'm going to show it to you here. You see right there that little Reddit button? Okay, well, when you click that, it puts in the title of the video and the description, and then it lets you put a subreddit. And when I put in the subreddit of games, it said I can't post a Let's Play there. So then I put in Let's Play, and there's a subreddit for Let's Play. Uh, well, as it turns out, and I don't even think Reddit is aware of this, or I'm just doing it wrong. That's always a possibility. No, no! Ah! Lava, you stay. I'm gonna move you, actually. But when you post Reddit, YouTube actually posts the entire Reddit and the subreddit to the main Reddit feed. Okay? Not my fault. But, I understand. Gotta follow the rules, and they don't care. I get it. Okay? Oh, hey, zombie, I see you. So I had a little little discussion because I kept posting and people were getting pissed off like, is this guy just dumb or is he blatantly de Oh, he dropped a potato. Is he de blatantly defying us or is he just an idiot? They couldn't figure out why I kept posting these reddits to the main feed when, you know, there was comments there and all I was doing was clicking a button and putting in the subreddit and that's it. 
So I didn't believe I was at fault. And we got it cleared up, and, you know, everything's honky-dory now. And I will, you know, do what I have to do. I just won't post to Reddit or figure out how to get it in the right place, because the YouTube sharing option, obviously, is very invasive, and also doesn't care what other sites' rules are. But at the same time, it's interesting that that happened, because I did notice that back in the day, in the golden age of when I played this, which I can get back, by the way, I'm sure of it, but during that time, one of the main reasons that my channel was so successful was because of the trolls. The trolls were there. And they trolled epically, and they kept things interesting. And I told them in Season 12, basically, to go away. And ironically enough, when I told the trolls to go away, go away, is when the view count started suffering, and the channel started suffering. Fancy that. So, as odd as it may seem, I am actively now asking for my trolls back. Please come back and troll the crap out of me because I need it! I do. I do, because I, I, I admit that I enjoyed feeding trolls and doing what I needed to do to, uh, you know, get people's attention and rile them up because they say, don't do it, and I would do it. I don't know, I just think it seemed it added the ultimate in entertainment value where it would have otherwise been lacking, and I'm really screwed now. Because, oh, I'm in the water, okay. Die! Die, mobs! You're not going to get me! Because I am- Oh, no! Matt! Matt! No! 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 Oh, there's two of them, I see. Well, guess what, Skellington? I have a diamond sword, and I know how to use it! <laughs> okay, that, that skeleton's gonna kill me. I'm, I'm a sitting duck here. There we go. Out of the way. I'm not running. I'm just regrouping. Oh, crap. Why did I do that? Okay. Go, 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 go. Wow, he's got a long range, man. Okay, so yeah, I need my trolls back because the trolls, when I would feed those guys, not not being rude or being nasty like I got after I was being frustrated when I was working third shift and couldn't commit all my time to the channel, which ultimately resulted in its, in its decline. Well... I miss those days, because that's where it was exciting. And I understand that since then, a lot, like a million people play Minecraft. Everybody's a Minecraft Let's Player. Yeah. But not everyone is necessarily good at it, okay? That's that's the point I'm getting at. And I, I know I haven't done much in this video so far, except rant about this and that. But it's important that I say these things, because then they go on record, and we can look toward the change in the future. I've also, oh, and the moon is going down already, so that's a good thing. Come here, spider. Looks like this is another monster hunting episode. Mind Force! Bull crap! Okay. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. That this is what's going on. I've also been spending more time in the Nexus than I am comfortable admitting. But more amazing things have happened in that area. And I have been reassigned to the Bayan Imperial Army, and I'm going to talk about that in a Nexus video that I'm, I'm making pretty soon. But that's a big win because uh, Aurons, who is uh, basically the, uh, the general's husband, I mean, he's up there, uh, remembered me. I thought he remembered my name, and he sent me a generic message about joining the army yesterday, and I said, holy crap, I can't believe it's you. And we got talking and reminiscing, and I met the general, and I got assigned a captain title, which is third rank from the top, as the captain of the Imperial Court, which is Elupig, which is the uh, basically the division that does community relations and diplomacy and runs events and games and all that fun stuff, and also does gatherings to keep the coffers of the clan full money, items, all that stuff, to keep everything going and keep the activity. So, that is good news because we ran a Rose Fest and got some of the highest ranked people in the entire game world, the primogens of many of the neighboring clans to participate, and they had a great time. They thought it was fun, simple, engaging, the prizes were good, and they approved. Thumbs up, Sorv. Good job. And it was a great first day back. And I've also got a little relationship going with uh, someone that I've been hunting with, and people are, are uh, hello daytime, people are uh, hinting about that. So that's a whole separate thing, but it's exciting stuff. So, I'm going to stop this here, I'm going to give you your 10 minutes for today, and I am actively growing reeds, which is a good thing. Because I really got, next, next episode I'll do this, because I want to start laying out the uh, foundation of the bridge system. 
I decided that I'm not sure I'm going to use that island, even though it's kind of neat. I think I'm going to scale that peak and see what I, I can get a view of the area. So we'll do that in the next video. You stay awesome. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. We're going to keep on going, so stay awesome, like I said. I'll see you then. Oh, yeah.